2017, huh? What a year. <laughs> Yo, what's going on, guys? What's going on, Ken Crew? It's your boy here, Ken. And I'm here to talk to you guys about what happened in 2017. There's a lot happened in 2017. A lot of good stuff, a lot of bad stuff, you know what I mean? But let's just reflect a little bit, and then I want to end with something as well that I've been working on. So, let's just start back in February. Uh, February, I think, I believe 14th, I started my YouTube channel as a result of a friend telling me that I needed to start YouTube because... Hey, what the heck? I be I'm the deep voice guy from Rachel's live streams. If anyone remembers that, dude, props to you. Like the video if you remember that. That's hilarious because I remember me being known as Deep Voice Ken and it was the funniest thing because people didn't know what I looked like and they're like, you have a deep sensual voice. And I was just like, oh yeah, that's me. I'm the deep voice guy. You know what I mean? And everyone's like, you don't look like you have a deep voice. And I'm like, okay. Long story short, um, that kind of spurred my YouTube channel. And I want to thank Rachel, Mr. Awesome, Mike's Monster Gaming, uh, Kayla, and there's so many more YouTubers. But thank you for building the base of my channel because without you guys, I wouldn't be here right now. I feel like you guys really helped me build my beginning of my community. And I have a lot of respect for you guys. And so I really want to thank you guys personally for that. Um, and there's many other people who have also helped me on this journey, you know, like my friends on Discord, my friends on social media, uh, my in real life friends, and I really want to thank them, of course, also as well for the support that they've shown my channel. It's been an absolutely amazing uh, journey so far, and it's not ending yet, guys. We have all of 2018 um, to really improve this channel, and I really... I'm telling you guys, I'm trying to work, I'm going to really dedicate myself to work hard on this channel. I'm working hard to get an editor as well. So again, if you guys hadn't seen my tweet, I really need an editor. So you can find my links in the description below for my Twitter, my Instagram, and you can also message me on YouTube. If you're good at editing or you know someone, please, please, please let me know. I'm in dire need of an editor. And so I really appreciate all the support with that as well. And then, like, what else happened in 2017? Oh yeah, well, I guess I have to address this, but I'm not going to address it as big of a deal. But guys, a lot of drama happened in 2017, and I don't mean to be like a super down kind of guy about that, but a lot of drama did happen in 2017, and so I want to address that in saying that I'm done with it. Like, it, I was very stressed in, in a lot of times, either I was indirectly or directly affected by drama, and I just hated every second of it, you know? And it was so hard on, on, on just like, you know, doing what I do because I felt so discouraged by it, and you know... I need, something I realized in 20, in just the end of this year is that it doesn't matter what other people look at you. It doesn't matter how people look at your content. It doesn't matter about the haters. It doesn't matter about any of that. What matters is if you're being yourself and you're doing the content that you love to do and people, it doesn't even matter if people are enjoying it. You do what you do because that's what you do. Just that makes any sense. It's like, it's like, don't don't be afraid to put something out there if it's funny something at vidcon that someone taught me was that sometimes the stupidest video things that you think you would never upload sometimes become the most popular things on youtube and it's proved by so many things like the thing that's usually top trending on youtube is usually someone recording something on their phone and it's usually really funny but it's like look those things get popular so don't be afraid to post the things that you think aren't popular because those are the things that are usually popular i'm being honest with you guys Markiplier said that himself. He said, don't be afraid to post things that you think are too silly because sometimes that's when you show your best work and your true personality. And that is so true on so many levels. So I don't want you guys to be discouraged by all this drama. I don't want you guys, 2018 is a new year for us and we're going to stop all this crap that's been happening in the background. You know, and I made a lot of mistakes too. I want to say that I did make a lot of mistakes. I handled things I shouldn't have handled things this way, but it's because I was being myself, and I really encourage people to be myself, their selves as well. Even if everyone turns their back on you, you need to be yourself because that's when you feel good about yourself. Um, but I'm tired of being fake. I'm tired of being this person who's like, hey, yeah, yeah, you know, I just mooched off of other people. No. I work hard for my content. I work hard for my subscribers, and I work hard for everything for you guys. And so I'm tired of hearing people say, oh, well, blah, blah, you helped... Da, 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 you're you're fake da, da, da. I'm like okay oh! now, there's one more thing I want to address and this is my last time because I've tried this video a few times and I really want to address it with this time and that's that there's something that's come to my attention for these past few months and I've been talking about it with a few friends and I really feel like this is this this is the move I want to create a place where smaller Nintendo YouTuber channels or gaming YouTuber channels can go to collab, share their ideas, talk, and have fun with each other and be on a down-to-earth level. I'm tired of going in these Discord servers where people feel so neglected and so left out because the, the YouTuber who is the leader of the Discord or is a part of the Discord is talking to only a select group of people or is 
just being the, doing their own thing. I feel like you shouldn't have a Discord server if you're not going to go and talk to people in your Discord server. There's no point. I mean, I get it's a cool place for people to talk about you. But then you should have a separate server for people just to talk about you. Because I don't understand what's the point of having a Discord server. Because the whole point of having a Discord server is to connect with your community. And if you're not doing that, I don't see a point of why you're having a Discord server. So, I want to create a place where everyone is put on an equal level. Of course, there's going to be mods and admins, but those are going to be put only to monitor the server. It's not a, it's not a uh, medal or an award or a stature of the kind of person or what kind of power they have. It's only to monitor the server. Um... And so yeah, and I really just want to create this place for everyone to where smaller channels can build each other up and share ideas. And that's the last thing I wanted to say. I'm still coming up with a name, more information. But if you do like the the idea, please leave me a comment down below of like a name of the server or something like that, because that'd be really cool. And I really please leave a like if you're showing support as well for this, because I really appreciate everyone who has shown me support this far. And there's another thing. Uh, there's one more thing I'm gonna close out before I say goodbye to you guys for, and this is gonna be one of my last. I don't want to see 2017 because it is 2018 when I'm recording this video, but. My last big video for that year to kind of summarize the year and that is I want to thank the um, six to ten people who um, actually come and watch my live streams um, and on a day-to-day -day basis and sometimes it's different people but I want to thank you guys because you guys are the reason why I do this like you know it doesn't even matter like you guys are the ones who are supporting my channel 24 7 and i really I really appreciate that and if you can't make the live stream because of the time zone i understand that as well but for those people who have been making it you know i've seen some crazy people be watching my stuff like really late at their in their time zone and i really appreciate those people because you guys really have touched my heart and i really appreciate that so thank you for all that support as well because you guys are amazing and I just love doing what I do because of you 10 people who usually watch my live stream. Even though I almost have 700 subs, it's those 10 that make me feel like I love what I like to do. So thank you again. And guys, to be completely honest, thank you for 2017. Through its ups and downs, it was still a year of amazing improvement. It was the beginning of my channel, so it's going to go down in history regardless of what happens. So thank you guys again for that support. And I really appreciate every single one of my subscribers, even if they never watched this video. Thank you. Thank you for what you've done and for everything that you've done. Let's take 2018 together. Let's do it. 10 to 1K, baby. Let's hit it. See you guys in the next video. Peace. Damn it, kid. Now everyone knows we're using a green screen. Don't, 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 don't.